real? It slipped out. Shh. I didn't think she was. Oh no, she's on top of the dorm. Run, run, Kate. Max! You gotta help her. No! Oh God! She can't die. She can't. Not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. Can you freeze it? Look at that, she's frozen it. Assuming I can't touch people, because if I do, it restarts. Get into the dorm. Yes. Max, stop! Don't come near me! Not now. It won't work. I don't have any power. Now I have to do this by myself? Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. You matter, and not just to me. I do want to believe that. Kate, your life is still yours, and we can get through this together. Let me help, like I helped by erasing all that crap people wrote on your room slate. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always feel like you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning, I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. Are you serious? Thank you so much. The fact that you don't care about that video and would come up here to stop me means a lot. I care about you because I believe you were drugged. We will find out who did this and make them pay. You sound so persuasive, Max. If only... Kate, I believe you. Will you believe me? Please, you don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up unless I put myself to sleep. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm already on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Kate, this is our chance to beat the bullies. That's the only way we can win against them. Can we really, Max? I don't believe in miracles anymore either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. 
If you come down with me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Max. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. You're my friend. Forever. Can we hug on it? No! Come on, step Nobody down. cares about me! Nobody! Wait, what? Kate, I saw that card from your father. You can count on him. He clearly loves you without question. Dad does care, even though I hurt him. He's the only one I know who believes in me. Come on, give me a hand. Step down, please. Please. Yes! Yes! I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Yes! What are you talking about? You saved me from talking in class. Yes, that's how we do it! Fuck yes. Now, I know today was difficult for everybody, but I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl's life. Of course, you're quite a hero for getting Kate to come down, Max. I didn't do much. She's modest. Like a real hero. Yeah, real hero. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. Oh, God. Oh no! What do I what do I do? What do I do? This is gonna affect the outcome of one of these people. But I don't like him. I don't like him. And he's gonna think, oh I'm just tattletailing on him because because of reasons. And I don't even know if he did do it. Jefferson did make her cry. But then he might react badly to it. Uh, I don't know. Mr. Madsen was bullying Kate. Oh, grow Excuse up. Excuse me, I was there. I saw you getting in her face. You have no idea what you saw. Kate Marsh was involved with a bad crowd. I was trying to find out who. Kate had a double life. I was super shocked when I found out. No, you were part of the crowd. And like I said, I personally saw David physically harass Kate Marsh. You lying little... Shh. Are you gonna take this troublemaker's word over your security officer? And he should take the word of somebody who harasses students? Max, I'm afraid this won't be solved here without proof and a thorough investigation. Now, if you have anything else to say... Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. I want to, I actually want to dob him in. Let's let's do it. Let's dob him in. Miss Caulfield, why exactly? Let's dob him in. 
All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're playing a liar. the field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before I'm we go. I'm happy with that outcome. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. Now, I bet if I had shot at the dude, I'd still have the gun and I'd still be I'd be able to show them said gun. But then Maybe the gun came from him. I don't know. Fuck it. Sign the statement. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. Nathan has gonna is gonna have a thing to say about this, isn't he? But I forced a, I forced his hand. Now give me a happy ending to the episode. Please. I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand. And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen. Ever! You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Not quite. Look at me. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. I'm still worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. <laughs> All over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. Lauren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather it's confirms this weird It's day. an eclipse. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. Get in there, mate. I believe you, Warren. I'll believe anything this week. Is he leaving?
Suspended, you're not supposed to be here. You can tell a whole empire. I don't have to see you right now. I don't have to see you right find out where this actually is? No. Hold on. He was building a dossier for her. I'm assuming he's building dossiers of people who've disappeared or died under his watch. So guys, that was episode 2 out of time for Life is Strange. I've got to say, it was a, a much better episode, I think. I enjoyed um, the interactions with the other teens more. Um, and you could see some of, the, uh, some of the choices from the last episode coming through. Then they're not really in your face like some of the telltale stuff that we get these days. Um, so yeah. Hopefully uh, Square Enix continues to build this uh, series up and hopefully uh, it stands toes to, to, uh, toe to toes with um, some of the Telltale stuff that we have. Um, today Game of Thrones is also released. Um, if you're watching this now, chances are I've played that first or at least uploaded that first. This was recorded before. Game of Thrones, but chances are it will be uploaded after. So, anyway guys, this has been the Argent Defender, and I will see you next time. And so these are my choices. I told Kate to go to the police. I answered the call. He didn't shoot Frankie. Uh, you blame Nathan. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Blame Nathan. Alright, that's it. See you next time.